Hello viewers, welcome to SRK Studio. I hope you are doing well. In this video, we are going to learn that how can we create a dynamic block in AutoCAD. So let's get started here. You can see that I have already created a dynamic block in AutoCAD. As I increase the size of the table, the amount of the shear also increasing. So how can you create this, this table? Let's get started. Here you can see I have a shear. Now I need a table three feet by three feet as you can see i have created a table now mirror this chair so as you can see the table and the chairs are here and now we need to open this in the block editor just type b in the command bar enter Pick point, click, now name this table, select object, enter, and press OK. So the table and chairs are open in the block editor. Here you need to learn something. Um, in the few things that uh, the parameter, we need to apply the parameter first and then we apply the action. So click on the parameters. Here you can see the linear, click on this. Click here and click at the second point and now click here. So now as you can see we have applied the parameters to this. Now we need to apply the action. Go to the action. Click on the stretch. Select parameter and now just click or here as we increase the size of this table here in the right direction. So now specify the first corner this is the first corner and now select the object select object just like this and press enter now let's check this click here as you can see the size of the table increases but there is no any limit so we need to apply the limit now double click on this open Click on the parameter and press Ctrl 1 for the properties. Here you can see the value set. Click on this and click on the list. As you can see the distance is 3 feet. Click on this and now increase the value 6 feet, 9 feet, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30. So it depends on you how much value you add it. So just click OK. And now check this. As you can see, I increased the size of the table. So the size of the table increasing in the addition of 3 feet. And this is the limit, the 30 feet is the limit. So now open uh, this uh, chair and table in the block editor because we need to increase the amount of this chair. So double click on this. Now, just go to the action, click on the array. As you can see, select the parameter. Now select object. We need to array these chairs. So select these chairs and press enter and as you can see enter the distance between columns the distance is three feet enter and now close this save changes as you can see i increase the size of this table and the number of the chair also increasing so this is how you can easily create a dynamic block uh, in AutoCAD so it depends on you if you have a room of uh, just like this and you want to set this uh, table and the and that is space so you can easily bless this just like this and it depends on you how much chair and table you want just like this so this is how you can easily create a dynamic block in AutoCAD. I hope you like this video. If you like this video, please tell me in the comment. And 
do subscribe my YouTube channel.